Ahoy hoy and uh, welcome to uh, another one of my videos this time we're doing an unboxing of a box set that I've uh, recently acquired it's the um, uh, box set of uh, Stephen King uh, paperbacks published under hard case crime um, these are uh, they it collects uh, the Colorado kid Joyland and uh, the most recent one later um, okay well these were uh, previously published in, uh, and were sold separately. Uh, so uh, what we're going to take a look at the, uh, what the content. So first the box. So this is the cover of, um, was it Colorado Kid? I thought Joyland. This is the cover of Joyland, original cover, of the paperback. And uh, these were, um, you know, sort of hard-boiled uh, crime novels that... Uh, Stephen King published outside of his uh, main publisher Scribner so these were never published under hardcover except as I believe there were limited editions of them that uh, really fetch for a lot of money on eBay so I um, figured those are not for me I'm good with these so yeah I originally t normally I would buy you know first prints of uh, Stephen King novels but the thing is the um, I like box sets as if you were watching my channel uh, the videos on my channel you'd know that I love box sets so I held out uh, this was released around the time that the third novel of the series later was released so anyway here's a look at the box so you got the, the front and this is the spine or the spine of the box I'm, I'm I usually display the other side so you know and this is the well what 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 normally is the back uh, for me though this is the main uh the spine and this is usually the front so they they, they it, it looks like this is intended to be displayed with this side facing out though normally i personally i would i display this with this side facing out so um so what's what's with the box i mean if, if you bought the these two or these three separately content wise you're not missing much however uh, let's take these out so content wise you've got yeah you've got the first novel uh colorado kid this is the illustrated edition that was published uh um uh well i don't i'm not sure how long after the first edition but yeah the key difference is that the pages have these uh, black and white illustrated pages like these so and this uh, sort of reflects the illustration on the cover uh, you got these they, they kind of look like those pulp uh, Hardy Boys you know those Hardy Boys books and Nancy Drew books that, that has these pulp illustrations I do have a, a copy of the of the first edition right here this is the first edition according to the uh, guide to the first editions that were published on uh, the Stephen King website um, where was it um, here we go the Colorado Colorado kid the published in 2005 hard case crime no uh, paperback no dust jacket um, it says the uh, identifier for the first edition is a running header on page 159. It says Grifter's Game instead of the Colorado Kid. So let's look for that. Page 159. Hmm. Hey, it's a fully booked bookmark. Um, so what was it? Page 159. Okay, so it's somewhere here, 1059. And I could have just bookmarked that before, you know, instead of doing this. So. 159 and it says grifter's game whereas the other page and on the other pages this is colorado kid here it says grifter's game so yeah i wonder what whose book is that but anyway this is a, so this is the first of first edition so you can see it's a a bit beat up i even made a custom a uh, plain slip case for it but you know just it was already in that uh, condition when got this got this super cheap like three dollars I think um, anyway yeah so going back to the box set so this is the a later edition 
um, Illustrated Edition. And then you've got uh, Joyland, which is the same as the original edition. It's a lot. Yeah, it's uh, slightly taller, though, because the uh, it, it, it had to match the other editions. I have a, a, a standalone version of this, and it's slightly less taller than the uh, um, other editions. And it doesn't have illustrations like the first one of the I believe there is an illustrated edition somewhere anyway and this is the latest um, latest edition oh, so, okay so this one has an embossed cover by the way the logo is embossed this this the, is not this is embossed so um, this is the latest novel called later and the thing is, if you haven't read any of these, um, they're pretty much, uh, you know, hardboiled. They're not horror novels. They're um, noir stories, you know, Chandler and you know, and all that. All that. But um, okay, the the main. If you already already have these books and you're basically um, getting the, you know, a nice box to go with it. Plus these uh, three postcards of the um alternate cover art for uh the book so you've seen the the first edition here so you can see the artwork isn't that um it's it's smaller than the original and it's it's uh, smaller than the books in the set much smaller but you know a nice gloss print on one side matte blank matte side no copyright uh, prints as they normally would. Um, you also have a, an art credit right here. See? And then got Joyland. I think this is the um, illustrated cover if, um, if I'm not mistaken. And then this is the cover to the um, the limited edition hardcover of uh, later. And there's the credit. So yeah, blank back. So yeah, that is a look at the Stephen King hard case crime box set. Um, the, it's not that easy to find, but then again, it's not super difficult. You know, I am not sure how many uh, print uh, copies are in print, but if you find one, I, I got this for like fifteen dollars on eBay. If you find a copy around reasonable you know twenty dollars would be reasonable so yeah um if you find good uh, if you're looking for this good luck and i'll see you in the next video take care